think back to the year of 1989. The Game Boy is released. And many people want in on it. So Nintendo calls up Konami. And they're like, Guys, Gunpei Yokoi just told us to make a console that's portable. And the screen is puke green. And we, we don't really get it. But that dude made us a lot of money. So he says jump and we say how high. And then he says very high. So we jump up into space and we suffocate. But that's okay because it's all part of Yokoi's plan. And then Konami says, all right, we're in on that. Give us, give, give us 18 dev kits, please. And this is what they produced. Except not this. This is the color version that they made later. And I don't know how loud this is going to be. Check. Check, check. A little too loud. Okay, check. Checking. Test. Ah. Uh. Okay. Just checking a little bit more. You know. Checking the volume balance. I think it could be a little lower. Check, check. Hello. Test. Hmm. Hard for me to say. Check, check. Simon Belmont, except this isn't, this isn't him. This is Christopher. It's a bit loud still. Okay. Yeah, probably. Let's try negative 18. All right, check, check. That's probably good, you think? Check. Ah. Uh. Good? Yeah, it's probably, probably good. I think my adjusted, like, it, it's hard to, it's hard to talk over me, really, like, I'm such a loud mouth. But, um, my, I think my adjusted compressor settings have, have lowered the <laughs> volume of my voice a bit, so I may need to compensate in the future. But I'm trying this out because I'm, I'm trying to eliminate those, those little volume spikes that happen. Anyway, let's play Castlevania. So many people consider this to be not not so good. I don't think it's that bad. I don't think it's that good either. Also, these are supposed to be mud men. Why are they green? Your mud isn't green? Well, it wasn't last I checked. Is he moving... Is he moving faster than he should be? There's a... There's an enhancement hack. Hang on, uh, let me check something. There's an enhancement hack for this, like, well not... That speeds him up a little bit. I don't want that. I want to make sure that I'm not running that. Let me compare to how he moves in the original. Uh, yeah. Hmm. I don't know, I can't tell. I mean, there's a little bit of lag. What do you think?
Let's see. One, two, three. Oh, wait, wait. One, two, three. Why would you not want the faster walk speed? Because it, because it's not true to the original experience. Basically, I'm a masochist. That's that's why. But yeah, I just have. Yeah, so like, there's there's an enhancement hack, and one version of this has that integrated, but I don't. I don't know if I want that. Also, there's a sequel to this game, a lot better. Castlevania 2, Belmont's Revenge, not to be confused with Castlevania 2, the other one. Nah, this might be about the same. I don't know. Let's see, let's do the wildly imprecise counting test. I have this turned up way too loud on my end. Well, now I got it too quiet, so I can't win. Okay, so let's see, let's see. One, two, three. Hmm. One, two, three. Yeah, it seems about the same. Maybe, I was just probably imagining it. Anyway, let's continue. If you know that I'm playing an enhancement hack, let me know in the comments below. Does this version run better somehow? I mean, it's very possible. It, uh, it's on Game Boy Color hardware. Now, this is, I should mention, this is an official colorization. Unlike the Mario, Mario Land 2 one I did, this is actually by Konami. They put this out in Europe. Oh, I should probably focus and play better. But yeah, most people consider this kind of a subpar Castlevania game. I don't know. It's alright, I guess. Like I said, sequel's way better. Like, if you want Castlevania on the Game Boy, go for that. Or you can just be like me and play all of them because that's what you do. That being said, music, music is fantastic. I think that's, I think that's worthy of bringing our old friend back. Uh, that is, that is Jerry Seinfeld. Uh, no, 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 not, not that friend. We don't want that friend. At least not right now. That's, <laughs> that's, that's maybe, that's about the quality of the game. That Jerry Seinfeld, but, uh. Here we go. Here we go. Here's our old friend. Corner Snoop. Okay, get me up there. What what's even going on in the background? Is like Is it like <laughs> multiple horizons. I don't remember if it's like that in the original. Oh, you mean uh, the blue, the the blue pixels? I don't know. I talked about playing the black and white one, but Langton said he pre would prefer this. So you know, this is what we'll do. It's the less common version anyway, so it's probably more interesting. Like, everybody's played the black and white version. This is... And it, this is a new look. Ah, cool. Birds. So, as I mentioned, this actually came out... Like, th that wasn't a joke. This actually came out in the first year of the Game Boy's life, so... So, you know, they got a head start on this. I've been watching Jeremy Par Parish Parish. 
I don't know how to say his name, but I know how to say his videos are good. And he's do it. He does a series where he's trying to, or tried. I don't know. I don't know if it's still ongoing at the moment. But he's talking about <laughs> talking about every Game Boy game released. There's a weird like. It's it's kind of f flickering. Yeah, I'm not sure that Konami optimized this that good. Who would have thunk? Oh. I lost my whip upgrade. Can I get that back? There we go. It's like Game Boy Color screen tearing. That's not like the stream, that's actually... <laughs> that's actually on my end. Oh, see, now this looks good. The background here looks great. Well, maybe Great's overselling it. But it looks good. Okay, that was the boss. Oh, I don't even get to grab an orb. Alright, Snoop, get out of here. So this isn't a particularly long game. This level looks pretty good, though. This isn't a particularly long game, I was saying. It's only four levels. The question is, will I be able to beat it in one try? That's... that is the conundrum. Ah yes, the power of Christ compels you. Okay, the weird... I don't know what this is supposed to be. It looks like a hand going like this. Ah. Ah. Mm. No. Ubi, die! Please. Oh yeah, this is still... This is still slow as molasses, yeah. Castlevania 2 doesn't improve that all that much, but it does feel better overall. What? Hearts are health? Yep. In this game, hearts give you health. Because there are no sub-weapons. I don't know if you had noticed. Ah! Well, that's one death. Rest one. And you're gonna start me all the way back here. Wondrous. Wondrous and grand. <laughs> mm. Video games. I love them. This is an indisputable fact. Gotta pad out the gamer stream somehow. Yeah, I'm thinking some of these, like, cheap jumps and whatnot were specifically because they realized their game was only about four levels long. Honestly, Castlevania 2, as much better as it is, isn't much longer. I mean, it's a little longer than four levels, but it maybe come, it comes out to about six, I think, in Castlevania 2. Okay, so I'm I'm trapped with baby whip. Mm. Stinky baby whip. Okay, now let's see if I can uh do this. Okay. You just got to you got to edge yourself real far out. Don't take that out of context. Uh, who am I kidding? Do it. I don't care. Do I, do I look like I fear anything? Uh. 
Okay, so here's here's something. So these guys will blow up the bridge if you attack them. So I'm probably gonna avoid that whenever possible. Ow. Oh no, the eyeballs of death. My sister's child was the child of death. They really know how to make you clinch your bum bum. Ugh. I hit that. Reports that I did not hit that were greatly exaggerated. Did you get a one up from for hitting ten thousand? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh no! I wanted whatever was in that. Okay. Whatever. I feel like there's some sort of maze happening here. Uh, I hate, I hate this. Uh, no. Or they just reuse the same screen twice. Also possible. This feels like a camera reset room, but it's obviously not. <laughs> I got that whip upgraded and I just immediately lost it. Lost it! Including my life. Okay, where am I gonna be? Oh, I'm right here. That's not so bad. I didn't have enough time to crouch. You cannot crouch mid whip. You cannot cancel your whip into a crouch. You also cannot jump. You all. <laughs> it's not very lenient. Okay, the flea man, the flea manhole. It's not a particularly glamorous boss. The boss music sounds like something out of a Game Gear Sonic game. Yeah, a little bit. Also, hey, Zero Kirby. Okay. This stage. Oh! Somebody filled it with pee! I probably should have hit that up there. Would it have been worth it? I don't know. Okay, so you gotta stop it from crushing you, crushing you into bone mush. Okay, wait, Snoop's coming back. Snoop's coming back. Okay, so <laughs> that doesn't work.
Okay, so I get a continue. I don't know if I get more than one. But I get a continue. But don't worry, we'll, we'll get the, the full experience of having to trial and error our way through this game. Okay, let it go all the way back up. Okay, book it. Book it. Don't care about no candle. Okay, maybe that one. Hang on, let's wait. Let's wait for it to recycle. Music's kind of slowing. Kind of lagging. Okay, now here we go to whatever this nonsense is. It's the spike floor. Oh no, it's the bug. The bug monster. Entered to death. Did the original Vania have these ropes? Nope. This is their replacement for the stairs. <laughs> this is what you get. Oh no, it rolls and it pulls. To, you have to get real high up which doesn't feel good because you know you got the floor of death chasing you Well, joke's on you, because this is Christopher Belmont. Oh! Oh, I have no hope for my life. And the Mercy Invincibility doesn't help you. Okay, so I get at least two continues. We're, that's the knowledge we're gaining here, at least. We get to figure out how many continues Castlevania the Adventure will give me. I don't think it's infinite. So is there... Hang on. No, he has a fixed jump height. So how do you get this? Oh, oh, I know how you get it. But then how do you avoid, how do you avoid dying? <laughs> I'm guessing you destroy it and then you go back real quick and hit it. Could be. Okay, so that's technically an infinite life trick you can get it. So that's actually very handy to know about. Also, it's very classy. It's just text that says one up. 
I don't know why I jumped there. It's not like he moves faster when he's jumping. I I think. I don't think he does. Mmm, I don't like this at all. Okay, so it, it stops there. The thing that sucks about dying here is you lose all your whip upgrades. Snoop's missing. Oh, I know. I got rid of him. And you can just... You can one-shot those things if you have it. Which is very useful. Oh, <laughs> I cannot describe in words how that makes my butt clinch. There is a clinchitude to that that cannot be understated. Eh, okay. Ugh, that, that doesn't feel good either. Oh, what? Yeah, it's supposed to do that. What the heck? Can this part, like, end soon? Please? I would enjoy... What? You douchebags! Oh my god. <laughs> yep, trials and errors. I am being put through trials and Konami has committed an error. And I just die here. Yeah, this is the level where the game kind of starts sucking the big one, doesn't it? It's like the first two, you're kind of... And, and now I just can't make it. I just can't make it. <laughs> is it just me or is there bug RNG? Does it turn the other way? when I spawn into this room? It's over there. Yeah, so sometimes the bug's just in a bad spot and I... I have to eat doo-doo. I have to eat doo-doo out of Dracula's septic tank. didn't go high enough. It's like, <laughs> it's so hard to tell. Okay, three. Unless I'm earning more. Or, or maybe they just made it infinite in this version, because I swear I remember hearing that they were finite. The only problem is that it spawns this thing back. Dracula's weird corkscrew device. For stream purposes, I hope they're infinite. I mean, for not stream purposes, I hope they're infinite. But fun may not be infinite with Konami Enterprises. Ugh. I don't need that. I don't need the heart.
Okay, so we got here with the whip upgrade again. Let's see what we can do. God, that... That feels so bad. Every time I don't feel like I'm gonna make it. Cool! Great! Awesome! Outstanding! Amazing! So I guess you just want to jump way earlier than you feel is comfortable. That's the trick. Except for when you don't. You know, the rope higher up, you don't want to do that. Because at least it, there, there's no time to jump over that. There's no time to explain. Like, you saw me flinch when I did that. If that doesn't tell you everything you need to know... See, th there I can deal with that. But he here... Here, it's like... So, when the spikes are about to touch it... That's when you want to go. Oh, God. God and Jesus in heaven. How am I alive? Okay, don't go over there to the idiot trap. Okay, cool, cool. No! <laughs> uh. You gotta get a... You gotta get a head start on the bug here. That's the only way you can succeed. I keep doing that! There's no... It's hard... It's so hard to tell. It's so hard to tell when you have enough clearance. Okay, please move. Okay, I actually jumped it that time. That's great. Okay, now. And you just, you have just barely enough time to make it. Oh cool, I thought I could dodge that, silly me. going for it. You can't go for it. <laughs> okay, are we going- do we get four? Yes, okay. So they, they might be infinite in this version. Which is honestly- which is honestly good. <laughs> Grab that, for it will come in handy on my quest. Uh, 
Is the limit really necessary? I mean, uh, define necessary, I guess. Personally, I, I don't hate it when games, like, are designed, you know, like, you gotta, you gotta do it in one go. You know, there's, there's a pressure to it that makes it, that does make it kind of exhilarating, but this game's a little too BS for that. Oh, the time limit? Uh, no, there doesn't need to be a time limit. Ah, uh, Michi. Okay, go, 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 go. Chris, get on with it. Okay, so hit it with the whip directly whenever possible. That removes the need to jump it. I hate those things so much. The falling platforms. In any other game, it's like whatever. In this one though, it reminds me of the futility of life. See, I'm always on the cusp of doing that. Every other time was a fluke. Can I just jump this thing straight up? Nah. <laughs> Not easily, at least. You know, I gotta say, this is a really good example of psychology in video games. Like, the first two levels are designed in a way that makes you think, you know, maybe I'll have fun. And then level three just pulls the rug right from- right out from under you. It's like Metal Gear Solid 2. The problem with this is you never know. It's like you don't know how much you're gonna need to get through this. How much clearance? It never feels like you have enough. Okay, here's the, the butthead trap. Oh, oh, that's radical. I hit the top of the screen, did you see that? Did you see me hit the top of the screen? Should have just skipped the Dracula's curse. Probably, but hey. This is a part of Castlevania history. And it does lay the groundwork for something much better later on. Actually, two things. Okay, so you can you can get a bit more of a head start than I thought. Oh dear. Oh dear oh dearie me. Would you like to come in for some milk and cookies, dear? Okay, don't don't go too early, because the ceiling will hit you. Dracula's invisible ceiling. Okay.
And this is still going on. <laughs> yeah, this is a... <laughs> this is a difficulty spike if ever I've seen one. Literally. I'm getting a little tired of hearing this song. It, it's a good song, but I'm, I'm tired of hearing it. My friends on TikTok send me memes. On Discord, it's memes. I was in a server, right? And all the channels were just Castlevania stuff. Yeah, there's gotta be... <laughs> there's gotta be infinite continues in this version because... It... it the, I don't remember what n number I heard, but it wasn't this high. But it's honestly good because <laughs> this part is some this part is some crap. This part is madness. Maybe even Sparta. Okay, but this is the obligatory one life I get with the whip upgrade. So I can't wait to die in a very stupid, easily avoidable fashion. You know, it's funny how... This, these tiles seem to be moving down on a non-integer basis. Because the enemies and Christopher don't quite align to it. You know, there's like a jittering empty space beneath their feet. But only sometimes, apparently. Even even then you're just kind of, you're you're by the skin of your teeth on that one. No! I hate you. You took everything from me. Okay, again, don't go don't go too soon. Dracula's patented invisible ceiling technology. It's so good, he uses it in in uh, Trevor's adventure. But only in the United States. And you might ask, what do you mean United States? I, I didn't. Because I thought I would hit the ceiling and I would die. I hate this part. This is like, this is Castlevania Turbo Tunnel. Okay, maybe it's not that bad, but it's not good.
This part hates you too, I know. It's not shy of admitting it. And if this was the original version, imagine how many times I would have had to play levels 1 and 2 just to get back here. Get me through, get me through! Da 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 You just, you can't dodge that one. I know I said that about the other one and then I dodged it, but you can't dodge that one. Not possible. And it just goes on and on for 40 years of my life. Oh, now we got the advancing wall. The murder wall of pain and death and agony. No, 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 no. Please tell me there's a checkpoint. Please, please. Uh, do I have lives? Please tell me there's a checkpoint. Oh, thank God. The mercy of Christ. See, this part's a lot better. I'm just afraid that I'll have to do the other part again. That bug clipped through the floor. You thought I wouldn't see it, but I saw it. Oh, no, 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 Please, please, the power, the power of Christ compels you, please. And it just keeps going. It just keeps going. No, 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 Get me out of here. Get me out of here. That is a secret. <laughs> I don't know how you would have known about that on the original Game Boy. Oh, thank you. Blessed be the name of God. Praise. Okay, what sort of boss are we looking at here? Come on, mate, I got like three and a half minutes. 
Yes! Get me out of here. Screw you, you gargoyle piece of garbage. I will never watch Disney Gargoyles. I've never seen this level before. Hey, it's... Oh god, this... This is go so good! Oh, oh. Little bit of bloody tears. Oh yeah. There's gonna be a second one. You know that, right? Oh no, it's just the it's the first boss as an enemy. Don't you just love when they do that? Oh, and there's heart of there's heart of fire too. I didn't hear it. Oh dear. You punk! No, no amount of screen tearing in the world will stop me now. See, so far, this is a much more... Maybe I should keep my mouth shut. But I was gonna say, this is a much more enjoyable level. I mean, it, no, it's still more enjoyable than the last one, but that's not a high bar to reach. Oh! <laughs> oh, there's that, there's that classic Castlevania. Okay, but there's a checkpoint here. And then I get a game over in this level, and this is where we learn that they're finite. No, I should I should deal with this guy first. Get that candle on the way back. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh. Can that thing, like, go away, please? <laughs> I hate those. Slow down. You gotta love when your already molasses-paced game has slow down. It's like the extra dollop of doo-doo on the turd cake. You have to jump so late. <sighs> okay. I have to start this level over, but it's not so bad. Look, I mean, usually... I'm against these kind of advantages in a game, but look, this is an official Konami release. You know, it's kind of like Nintendo adding the Swift Sail to Wind Waker. This is a change that Konami themselves felt it pertinent to make. 
so you know what I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lose too much sleep about it <laughs> crud oh <laughs> you really need you need the whip upgrade for this I mean, even in Contra, like, you have to use a cheat code to get it, you know? This is just a revision of the game. Like, if you bought the game late, this is how you could have played it. You don't have to, like, cheat or anything. I mean, I don't know. If it, if it bothers you that I played it like this, I, I apologize. But I, I don't think people wanted, like, a million streams of this game. I don't think that would be a particularly popular request. Yeah, you, you need that, because if, he, if you don't kill him fast enough, he just respawns. Oh, great. Cool. The orb of confusion. Spit out by Ubi. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. Hmm. Slow. Just how I like it. Yeah, it really is very beneficial to me that you can cancel knockback into a rope. Or the rope cancels knockback, I mean to say. Cool! I didn't want that- I didn't want that whip upgrade! <laughs> didn't need it. D didn't need it! Whip upgrades are for wusses. I am a big man with big chest hair. I cut down trees. With my bare hands. I ate a bowl of nails for breakfast. You know, actually, I take it back. Whip, up, whip upgrades are pretty good. I would like to keep this one. Okay, there you go. Again, you just have to jump way later than feels comfortable. Oh, uh, you know, I, I don't like this. I, <laughs> hmm, I don't like this. These guys only take one hit no matter what. That's nice. That being said, for all the trouble I'm having in this level, it is so much better than the last one. 
Like, holy crap. I feel like they made the last one extra bullcrap just so you would be playing the game longer. Like, I, I think it, they just made it extra, extra poopy as a sort of padding. Because this level is a lot more reasonable. I mean, I wouldn't call it high art, but it's, you know, it's reasonable. Beyond some flaws just inherent with the game. Okay, so they can fire these, like, up or down, I think. And that makes a big difference. Just like, please. Can I have something for once in my life? Okay, so what do you want to do? You want to do this, and then you want to jump here. Okay, that... <laughs> that doesn't kill you, surprisingly. The whole uh, jumping into the spikes or jumping into the spikes does, but having the platform intersect you surprisingly does not kill. Or at least I glitched it to where it did not kill. Yes, okay. Can I hang on to this? It's like in Mario games where I get the hammer suit and then hit the first Goomba I see. Okay, jump here. Jump here. Ah, yes. Okay, good. Yeah, I had a feeling... I had a feeling you would have me do this again. This is honestly an easier configuration, though. Uh, yes, do the same thing, but in reverse. And with more spikes this time. You know what, actually, let him, let him creep in a little bit. Okay, well, I got hit. I got mildly pained. I do like the enemy that forces you to, like, consider whether or not to duck. Or, you know, not duck. It's a, that's a very Zelda 2 design decision. Okay, so remember that getting knocked back into spikes is still death, even though you should have mercy invincibility. You don't. This guy can just ruin your birthday party anytime he feels like. Oh, okay. Do they ever retract? Okay, yeah, they do. <laughs> Thank you, Christopher. Thank you. See, it's a well-known complaint of platformers that when you press the jump button, your character jumps. So I'm glad this game is making new innovations by not having that.
Poop and crap and maybe even a butt. Your pure projectiles are despawning, which is very fortunate for me, actually. Okay. <laughs> they throw a lot, they throw a lot at you here. Yeah, it would have taken me like a million years to beat the original version. Okay, that was actually pretty sick. Aren't you glad I did that? Yeah, eat crap. Eat. A, eat a dungaree. Why are there so many of these? God. I mean, I know it's the last level, but... Come on, mate. Okay, well, I got hit by that one, but I can get it back over here. I wanted the fireball, but it's, you know, it's better than nothing. Okay, well, my hair touched the spike, sorry. Give me the super whip upgrade right as there's no more enemies to kill. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, the, this is just, like, this up here is just the same configuration mirrored. And I mean it's symmetrical, so that it's not even interesting. Okay.
Okay, you know, it's looking a little millhouse. But will it last? And no, it won't. Millhouse has left the building. Okay, I got greedy. <laughs> I got greedy. You have to position yourself nice and good if you want to get that. I kind of do, though. I kind of do want to get it. It makes enemies die more. Of course I want that. Okay, I think I'm starting to get the pattern of this room down. Cool. Ugh. No, I... No, wait, 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 wait. That's how you do it. That's how it's done, boys and gentlemen. Okay, here here I don't need to do any fancy jumps! How did that not instant kill? I... What game am I playing? And there's a heart on top. What game am I playing? Though, I'm down to dinky whip. Super dink. Did somebody ring the dinkster? Okay, generally, I do not like the position you have put me in here, game. And there's gonna be another one. You know that, right? Well, okay, it gave me help. And I'm dead. Dang it, Millhouse. You know, Millhouse would probably be another good emote idea. Might do that after this stream's over. Used to signify good fortune. Uh, cool. Cool and red and bodacious. I am not going to be able to kill the other guy. Life is gonna kick me in the butt later. It'll bite me in the butt, rather. The game's already kicking me in the butt. It's just going to add a new method of torture. So these guys were dying in one hit before. Did something happen? I mean, I know I had the whip upgrade, but they, they were dying to the regular whip at one point at, in one hit, I swear. See, if you have the whip upgrade, you can just mangle that dude.
and that dude. Oh, uh, my, my swag has not carried over. I had swag in a bag. And now I'm just... Something else that rhymes with that. That is an offensive. This run is not very Millhouse. Sometimes you just you don't have any faith in a run anymore. And that is right now. Yeah, where, where did Millhouse go? There's no way I'm getting to Dracula this attempt, but you know. I won't cut it short. We got plenty of stream. That m could maybe be said as a negative. Saying we have plenty more dust in stream is like saying we have plenty more uh, dung beetles. I don't know. I didn't want to say. I didn't want to say doo doo again. But I kind of did anyway, because that's what that's what they're named after. The poop bugs. Can we hang on to this whip upgrade? Mm, so far, so good. But then there's like one of these hands up here. Yeah. But I know the pattern. I know exactly where to whip. And then I get to this guy. And he's like, hi. Okay, I can't wait. I don't have any time to waste. Great! Great! I can't wait to bomb some Dodongos. My toe! My toe! Shock. 
Don't worry, I grow ever stronger. Dracula ain't gonna know what hit him. Much as I didn't see that coming. Even though I've been through this 500 times. It's like, I don't... I, I hate these guys. I just never know what to expect out of them. Oh, I'm doing... I'm doing especially bad with Ubi right now. That did not hit me. I'm sorry. That, that, that would be a technical foul. Like, what do you do about that? Christopher carries his momentum, that's fun. That's the good stuff. Okay, so please don't touch a spike. Okay, cool. You remember when I said I had the pattern? You remember when I said I had the pattern? <laughs> oh, this game starts off. This game starts off so hopeful. And now look at it. Yeah, could I have done that last time? When I had the whip upgrade? No. Alright. How many lives do I got? One. Oh. Okay, I forgot these aren't instant death. That being said, they sure don't feel good. And now I gotta fight this guy with no whip upgrade. Just 
See, if I had a whip upgrade, that would have been over. Hoping I could just make a run for it. Nope, can't do that. Yeah, these guys are just random, I guess. Like, will one appear in front of you or behind you? I don't know. Sure does go on forever, though. I mean, I gotta beat this, because you know... You know this is like my only chance, I because I am never going to probably do this ever again. <sighs> this guy. This guy right here. Ain't he just a beaut? Ain't he just a marvel of modern engineering? You come back to it in two or three years. I mean, I guess, but am I going to? That's the question. Listen, man, I got this. I got this under me thumb. There has never been a man who has had something more than I have this. I thought for a second I missed that. But no. <clears throat> the rope was not a dope. Unlike me. <laughs> and I just, I fall into these same easy mistakes that I thought I had gotten past 400 years ago. It's just that's the thing is you get you get good at one part and then you just lapse back into your old cruddy habits You know you think you're over it you think oh wow rehab has really done me some good And then you just you see it sitting on the table I can still do this, though. I bet you thought I lost that power. No. I have just chosen not to use it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Nice golden windows. Uh, sorry, hit the button a little too late. Lost my whip. Lost it. I can never do that when it actually matters. Ah, oh, come on. Well, that's all right, I guess. We're, we're inching. Inching forward. Spikes on the wall They're gonna fall And then I'll have to clean it up I think you spent more time on this level than the last one. I still stand by my opinion that this one is better. Okay, can I keep this? No, I can't. Wonderful! If I could just, if I could get past this segment with the whip upgrade, I would, I would go far in this life. Because it's this, it's this joker that keeps making my life hell. Without the whip upgrade, this guy is just nonsense. That's what he is. They could give me a whip upgrade here, they just choose not to. Wait, hang on. I might have a strategy. No, because he respawns. Okay, okay. Maybe we got something. Maybe we got something here. Refill health. Whip upgrade. Okay. Let's see what we got down here. Long freaking fade out. Oh yeah, this is this is Drax room. Okay, so he kind of does like a Mega Man X bullet pattern. Okay, that doesn't work. Oh dear. Actually, this is a good position. Oh no! I touched Dracula's robe! But, bright side, 
bright side, we have seen the light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah, unfortunately, it just wasn't clutch enough. But hey, like I said, we, we've seen the light. We know we're getting close. Getting a little better each time. That's what it's all about. No, 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 no. But wait, hang on. I did manage to dodge it. Okay, never mind. Go to hell, please. Worst enemy in the game. Not even the armor dude is worse. At least I can tell what the armor dudes are doing. This guy is a complete mystery up until he actually fires the shot. I think motorcycle dude might have just dro drove by. So that's cool. Glad to see he could show up. He's the he's the true Dustin Stream regular. Like not even Langton or Miles come close. It's all about getting the rhythm. Okay, he's got to come in closer. <laughs> yeah, wait till his projectiles start despawning. Not very fun for him, but it's fun for me. Oh yeah, baby. Oh, Millhouse. Okay, Millhouse over. But it's not going that bad, even still. Knock on wood, I guess. Okay, come on. Ah, oh, crud, that was so close, too. Oh, you can just fall there. That's good. That's a lot quicker. So that's the trick, really. Just a t trick them into attacking upwards. I mean, I'm tanking a lot of hits, but it's kind of what I have to do. Oh, 
Okay, I may have I may have messed up ever so slightly. Oh, that's that sends you back, dude. Not a fan of that. This is what I get for using the name of Millhouse in vain. What's with the, what's with that, like, over there? I don't get it. Like, if I could just get to that last area with this whip upgrade, then I could, I could clean house. And it's not going to be this time. You know, we don't usually let people get here with the whip upgrade, and today is no exception. Like taking Yoshi to a ghost house. It's like bringing a Morgan to a Morgan fight. Oh, thank God it didn't respawn. It was going so Millhouse for a minute there. But like I said, light, the tunnel, all that good stuff, you know. Ow. That, however, is not the good stuff. Yeah, honestly, as far as Dracula fights go, the one in this game seems fairly easy, but I'm not discounting the possibility that there might be a phase two. That comes out way faster than I expect it to. I mean, the Simon's Quest one was a joke. That's true. You have lost your snoop privileges. Okay, come on. This is the run. Yeah, you gotta go down on the rope or else it doesn't count. C 
Cool. Goes right down the hole. But listen, that's not that's not the measure of a millhouse. Any man can be millhouse if he sets his mind to it. Yeah, honestly, it pays to be proactive with that, rather than trying to dodge it. You know, it's been so long since I hit this, I forgot what was even in it. But it must not have been that good if I never felt the need to go back. And what the heck, I'll grab it. It was a coin, yeah. Oh, okay, I was scared I jumped a little too late for that one. Yeah, you can't dodge. There's no dodging to be done with that guy. You just have to wait for him to get close enough to despawn. Also love this guy. Okay, come on, come on. First time I've managed to get past this without taking a hit. Now to take it here like an idiot. You know, the one thing I've never... Okay, nah. Okay, we might have something going here. Just maybe. Oh well, it, it doesn't matter that much. It, I, I just wanted it to get through this room, right? I mean, having the fireball would be awesome, but... I really just need to get through that room so I can get to Dracula. Okay, that was not... That was not a good life. But it respawns me right here. So I got at least one more try. Admittedly, I didn't see how many lives I had.
I should probably be a bit more cautious. Ugh. Okay, here's my strategy. Oh dear. I should probably not stand. Oh, actually, I think I'm safe. Okay, Dracula. Oh, yep, there's a phase two. <laughs> oh, geez, I, <laughs> I don't know about this. Well, I have a good strategy for Drac phase one. If nothing, if nothing else, I know how to beat phase one pretty reliably. Okay, so just sit down here and next he'll, he'll come here. Well, okay, that worked before. Okay, I'll try a little bit more, but I'm reaching the end of my rope, no pun intended. Okay, this is not a good arrangement. This is not a good omen. The stupid balls! Fireballs, yuck. If this, if this game had a password system, that would make all the difference, I think. It's just the fact that I know that if I wanted to try this again, I would have to play the whole game. I think that's what makes it worse. This is a game that really needed one. I don't know. Maybe, maybe again, it's just stream... Extreme paranoia setting in. 
Maybe if I was playing this on my own with less pressure, it wouldn't bother me so bad. Okay, so this guy, just wait for him to close in. Okay. All right, cool, cool. Yeah, yeah, awesome. Awesome and bodacious. I hate the hands. The, the hand-looking things are the worst enemies in the game, bar none. Not even these guys compare. I've said it before, but it really is true. go back to this joker and like I said I can hit that ball when there's nothing at stake I almost dodged that. A first in Dustin stream history. Okay, okay. So, when you know that that last one's gonna come out faster, it's not as bad. It, it really is, again, trial and error. I hate to say. Why are you walking that way? Okay, so we actually made it through the entire room. So we might have a fireball, actually. Which will be a first. I love how long it takes to, <laughs> to load into Dracula's room. Ah, oh, crap. I did it way too early. Oh well, okay. Not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. Oh, I <laughs> I thought for a moment I had found a strategy.
Not even bothering. I touched the top of a bat. I don't know. Like I said, I'll try a little bit longer. I might go slightly over my two hour expectant stream length. But I don't know. I can't promise that I'm going to beat this. As I'm sure you've come to expect at this point. It's just, it's just asking a little too much of me. Okay, so the strategy is to like stand up here, except nah. Okay, one more attempt. That's all. That's what I'll give it. I'll give it one more go. And whether I beat it, whether I beat it or not, that'll be it. And like Langton said, maybe I can revisit it at some point, but. She's asking a little much of me. I mean, I think this is one of those games that few will blame me for not having beaten, though. I would like to be able to say I had. Yeah, I'll still give... Okay, Spinball... I didn't want to, like, spoil it or anything, but Spinball may happen again very soon. I can't promise I'll ever be able to beat Dynamite Heady, because that game is hard as all hell. But I will try. Hello, Gray's Coffee Shop. All right, first time I managed to get the fireball here. So, that's a mill house if ever I've seen one. How are you tonight? I'm okay. You know, nothing. Nothing to brag about, but nothing to shake a stick at, I suppose. Just kind of all right. But all right's good enough. As are the Goonies.
At least that's what I've been told. Ah, crud. I still have an advantage here, though. Because, you know, it goes down like a Mario power-up. You know, it goes down in tears. <laughs> Just pop by to wish you well. Happy streaming. Quick kick Dracula's ass. Uh, thank you. Here's hoping. Ah, crud. Well... It is what it is. Hey, I dodged that this time. Okay, yeah. I'm definitely getting in the groove of this. Which is kind of a shame because I was planning on stopping soon. Yeah, you just... If you want to get through this at all decently, you have to have the whip upgrade. It's non-optional. And I just lost it, which is not good. Okay, but we got through the room. That's the important thing. Would have been nice to have like a fireball, I guess, but... We're not poorly equipped, I suppose, is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> this, this room's layout is so awkward. I mean, I understand why it's like this, but... Crap, I missed a- I missed a hit. Crap. Bat crap. They call that guano, you know. <laughs> Crud. Okay, I- if zero counts as life, and I think it does, I got two more tries. And then I'm gonna call it.
crap. No, homing bat. Crap, no. <laughs> Poop. Except for the ones that do. <laughs> I almost jumped back on top of that, and that would have been the worst thing ever. Just hang out here till it's safe. I can't play this no more. Shh, I'm gonna do something secret. I'll see you later.